this problem, this video is all about finding the smallest angle of a triangle. Now, if side A is given as 3 plus root 3 and side B is given as 3 root 2 and side C is given as 2 root 3. So now, if you have a triangle where you have A, B, C, if side now you have this is side A, this is side B, this is side C. Now if if side C is less than B and C less than A, it then now means that angle C is the smallest. That means if here is smaller, is the smallest, then this angle will be the smallest. If here is the smallest, then this angle will be the smallest. If here is the smallest side, let's say here is 3, here is 2, here is 6. So since this one is 2 and is smaller than this and this, then this angle A will be the smallest angle. So now let's check which one is the smallest. So now we have... A to be equal to what? 3 plus root 3, while B is equal to 3 root 2, while C is equal to 2 root 3. Now, since these are rational numbers, for us to know which one is bigger, what we're going to do is square them. Now, let's find a square. So a square, you say 3 plus square root of 3, all squared. It will give us 9 plus 6 root 3 plus 3. So if you add this and this, this will give us 12 plus 6 root 3. Now let's square this. You have B square will now be 3 root 2 square, which will give us 9 times 2, which is 18. Now, let's do this C square. You have 2 root 3 all squared. This will give us what? 4 times 3, which is 12. So, this gives us 12. So since this gives us 12, 12, C square is C square is equal to 12. And 12 is less than 12 plus 6 root 3. So it means that and this is equal to A square. So it means C square is less than A square. And again, C square, which is equal to 12, 12 is less than 18, and 18 is equal to B square. So if you check now, from this, it implies that C is less than A, and from here, it implies that C is less than B. So the, the smallest angle is angle C, which is angle A, C, B this angle here. So that is the smallest angle. So now let's solve for the smallest angle now. Now to solve for the smallest angle which is C, we now say cos C is equal to, using cosine rule, is equal to A square plus B square minus C square divided by what? 2AB. So an A is 3 plus root 3 all squared plus B is 3 root 2 all square minus C, which is um, 2 root 3 all square divided by 2 times 3 plus root 3 times 3 root 2. Now let's open up that this bracket up here. If you open up this bracket, you have 9. Okay, let me just say 3 plus root 3 times 3 
plus two, three plus this will give us 18 minus this one will give us what 12 divide by 2 into 3 plus root 3 times 3 root 3 so if you, if you open up this bracket we now have 3 times 3 is 9 3 times this this 3 using this 3 to multiply the whole of this is 3 times 3 is 9 3 times this is plus so the whole of this will now give us if you open up this bracket the whole of it will give us 9 plus 6 root 3 plus 3 plus 18 this 18 minus this 12 divided by what 2 into 3 plus root 3 times 3 root sorry this is 3 root 2 sorry Two. Now this will now be equal to three. Nine plus three will give us twelve plus eighteen plus six root three minus twelve divided by two times three plus root three times three. Two. Now, this twelve, this twelve minus twelve will cancel each. We cancel each other. So now you now have at the numerator eighteen plus six root three divided by now two times three will give us six root two times three plus root three. Now, if you check this two, you see that six is common. So factor out six from this. We have six into six divide eighteen will give you three plus six divide six root three will give you root three. Divide by six root two into three plus root three. Now these are the same. You we'll cancel out, and six will also cancel out. You now have one all over root two. So we have cos C equal to 1 all over root 2. And you know that here is 1, here is 1, this is root, this is 45. Now, and here is root 2. Now, then cos C is equal to 1 all over root 2 which shows that cos c is equal to what 45 this implies that c is equal to cos inverse of 1 all over 2 which is cos 45 because if you look from here cos 45 is equal to this is adjacent all over hypothesis so now 1 all over square root of 2 so that means your answer for C which is the smallest angle is 45. Thank you for watching till the end. Have a nice day.